there somewhere. I don't know they're all hiding while I'm unpacking that thing. All hiding? Nice box that says Team Yeah, <laughs> Odie shipped me one from the UK. Oh, this is for Odie? Yeah, I think we're going to need another cart for them. Yeah, we're definitely going to need another cart. You want to put this one, put that on top of mine? Do that. You show Mr. Scott your jersey, man? Yeah, we well, definitely brought a lot of stuff. Yeah, we don't travel a lot in this family. <laughs> At least you drove and didn't have to pay for all this on the plane. Yeah. Right? See, I got both my complexity members in training here. One is hiding behind a toy. This is Allie and this is Jordan. And the reason this event is special is this is their very first ever esports event. Daddy's been traveling all over for 10 years and they've never had a chance to come, so we're super excited to have them here. I've got to balance family and complexity. God, family, complexity. And um, I miss many esports events that I'd really like to be at because my kids come before complexity. And they have never been to an esports event. Daddy goes to the airport or daddy drives to Anaheim, they're doing their thing, I'm, you know, and I'm down here. It's just too much going on usually. So we brought in the whole crew and <laughs> it's like an entourage. These are the five streams that go out, okay? And then we have, so what happens is there's a wire. I'm gonna show you, all this stuff goes to a wire. There's a satellite truck outside that beams the signal up to a satellite that's actually- In space. The planet. Some of these guys are real famous in the community. Husky over there. You've probably seen him on the air before. There's DJ Wheat down there. You've definitely seen him before watching with me, huh? I always felt like this was going to get big, but it's amazing what's happened to it. And, and you know, just to, to see people that would be willing to wait in line for three hours to get an autograph of somebody who talks about games on a camera. I mean, it's incredible. And one of my more memorable experiences was just walking through this very hotel last year with Dong Regu, and it was like walking through with a celebrity. From the moment we got in the elevator, we had five people in the elevator, you know, know who he was, kind of whispering, and then they finally got up the courage to talk, and then walking through the hotel lobby, stopped at least 20 times for autographs, and, you know, it, it's, it's incredible how big this has gotten. Jordan. Big, big. You man, speak up. Allie, say hello. Ernie. Oh my God, very pretty, very pretty. <laughs> <laughs> what do you say, Allie? Nice to meet you. Me too. Right from the oh. swimming pool. No trouble. No I'm Gosu. trouble. <laughs> What's trouble? Gosu. <laughs> you put trouble on his signature. No trouble. <laughs> it's it's cold. Cold. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. No trouble. No trouble. So they have some time, or what time do they have to play? Uh, they're warming up at 6.30. So they have to Oh, they got a little bit. Yeah. So we just want to go over some things. We met with the American players um, Wednesday night but you guys were sleeping, so we're gonna meet here. Yeah. Make sure we're all on the same page. Just a few things. One, New Jersey's. Yeah. Yeah? Very good. Yeah. Um, don't make sure that you have the jerseys on anytime you're in the convention center. Yeah. Even if your tournament is over, yeah. you still wear it because oh. people still uh, take pictures, uh, okay. okay? And video after the event, big party. Yeah, yeah. Okay? Perfect. Yeah, Perfect. yeah. 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 Um, Team Liquid. E.g. Dignitas Complexity, very important, uh, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, the managers will be there, yeah. but Jason Bass and yeah. me, we have to go. Uh, we can't be there. Uh, um, next thing is new sponsor, Yeah. Pam. Um, very important, like at the photo shoot, yeah. very good. Okay. Don't drink a lot until you're sure. Maybe you play good, yeah, yeah. maybe you play Chobo. Uh, okay? <laughs> Don't okay. drink before GSL. But, too. but always, okay. always when you play, have this in here, okay? If, if you're in the booth, the big yeah, booth, yeah, yeah. on the stage, when yeah. camera's on you before yeah. you play, okay. this. You don't have to really drink. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Just fake. Yeah, yeah, just fake. Mm -hmm. Jason Lake acting Jason's one on one. <laughs> but do you, do you understand what I'm saying? Okay, I understand. Okay? Because okay? yeah, yeah. when camera's on, yeah, everyone yeah. watching, you hold it in the grooves. Okay. Yeah. There you go. When playing on the floor, okay. computer here, monitor. Yeah. Right, right. Oh, okay, so it doesn't okay. bother you, but we're, when people take yeah, pictures, yeah. it's hard. You know, boom, boom, yeah. gamma. Okay, we yeah. take pictures, send to the company, yeah. okay. say, okay. hey, we good team, yeah. a lot of gamma yeah. photo, <laughs> video. Trimesters are out. Sure. In American tour. Hey. You probably don't have to. Uh... 
That was you three months down the drain. I mean, all the expectations I feel right now are just mostly for me. I think a lot of people aren't really expecting much. They're just waiting to see what happens. Uh, yeah, I mean, for myself though, I just really want to do well. You know, I know it's a bummer to come out of that thing and you got a long face, but you got to pick yourself back up. But when you have disappointment and you have all these negative vibes, you got to direct them one way or the other. You know, direct it towards, you know what? I am not only disappointed in myself, I'm seriously pissed off. I got out, knocked out of a North American event. Boom, boom. After three months of busting my ass in Korea. Or you could be like, I'm seriously pissed off and I know I can do better, so I'm gonna take all that energy and I'm gonna go do better. I can dig it. We'll wait and see what you do with it because nobody can do it for you. I mean, I can give you all the old man speeches and all the old man stories and all that crap. Cameras or no cameras, straight up. It's the real deal and if you can grab hold of it, it's a lot of fun. I've thought about quitting more times than I care to even admit to. Um, I've had many highs where we're on top of the world went holding big trophies and fans are just blowing up websites saying how we're just the bomb and, and many lows. You know, I moved my family across the country, sold my law firm to go into eSports with uh, DirecTV and uh, you know, the economy tanked and it didn't work out. So I went from employing, um, you know, 30 people, 50 people at any one time and being the boss of two companies to uh, basically being unemployed. Is, is that that? No, it's not. There's people playing up there. They're just playing here. This is this. This is this is it. That's it. Why does he get a big speed? He's not big name enough. He's our best hope of doing really well. This is hard. Heart, yeah. I think he's gonna win this. I, I think he's a good chance. Yeah. So now he's pulling his workers. So so that now that's a good sign because he's lost all his all his uh, army units. And the heart's just taking out everything now. So he's about to take out the space too. Yeah, heart. Woohoo! <laughs> so now he's taking out all the structure. Took out his base. So he's, he's doing really well right now. So there's a good chance he's gonna win this. So pretty soon the guy's gonna G say GG, and then that means good game, and then they're gonna go to game three. Job. One one now. What happened? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it lags a lot. Okay, let, let me get a let me get a uh, ref. He says he can't control his uh, computer because he's been lagging so much. I'm sorry, because I, I was watching it from over here. There was no lag. That's On your weird. side, there was lag, right? Your side was lag. You're gonna watch it now, so we'll be able to see. Oh, okay, thank you. So we're gonna restart the computer, and he is now repping the station. He will be looking at this screen the whole time. It's not looking so good. Uh, It'll be the greatest comeback ever. Greatest comeback ever. Hey Chris, what's the supply? 147? Oh, he's screwed. The top right number, it says 83. The other guy has like 147. Oh, this is over right here. Do you have lag this game? Do you have lag this game? Yeah? You did? Hey, really? Yeah, I, I, he looks really upset. That's his first match. You can't let it get to his head, you know? Uh, he's our, he's our uh, number one hope, I would say. Maybe Hope and Origin player come to change? Yeah. Very fast. Uh huh. No, 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 I, I know what you're saying. Yeah, he's saying, like, it is unfair because. Like when the foreigners, like when something's wrong with their computer, like they'll change right away. When the Koreans, yeah. Yeah, no, but it's gonna, it's gonna be fine. You're gonna take a deep breath, okay? From now on, if there's anything, every, every time there's a little bit of lag, you need to pause it, okay? And let me or Jane know, okay? That's my fault. Next time I'll make sure that the computer slips out, okay? Head in the game, okay? You still got this, don't worry. All right, we're gonna be fine, we're gonna be fine. If Dobler wins this, he qualifies top 16 World Championship Series. Ghost, Ghost user. His last name's Dobler, Michael Dobler. Come on. He's the only one still left in WCS, so he's the only one left.
in the World Championship Series. Everyone else is out. This is it right here, baby. Come on, finish now. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, Dobbler. IDs gave him such a show going out. I should have ended this hours ago. Oh! Yes! Yeah. Top 16 in WCS. Good, that's what we need, man. We need someone going. Yes. Hey, thanks. Yeah. Drew it out a little while, I was kidding. He was, uh, he got a big event, the stupid Dark Templar drop. I didn't expect that at all. Yeah. He, was he, he was floating a lot, that's why he stayed in. Yeah, he was floating like 5-3. I knew I had it though when I, uh, when I Vortex his mothership. Or when yeah, I yeah, yeah. Seriously, then Vortex his army. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah, then the ultra list is it's really great when you win. It's probably the best feeling as a competitive gamer when you beat someone, especially another like good player who like you weren't sure if you could beat or if you're about the same level. I don't know. When I lose, I just want to go and practice more and get better and not lose again. It kind of in tournaments it stinks because you only have like one chance and then you're out. Even though it's the best of three, a lot of the time you go to third game and then if you mess up once or anything, then it's just over. I look tough. Yeah. Yeah, you put your thumb in there and you hit somebody, you're gonna break your thumb. Yeah, if you put your thumb in there. Okay, as um, soon as he's done, bring him out right away. You see how that happens? What? Not like this, maybe more like this. Really? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Like this? Yeah, like this. 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 Yeah, this. is very, very awkward. I do know that I absolutely can safely say I would kick your ass. So, so you're gonna first shot, I want you to... Just hold it out like this. Okay. Go shoot that. Shit, man. Arm to the side there. All right. Yeah, it's easier about punching people. <laughs> I will play Dollar's no, no. theme song. <laughs> one, kind of same, same shot like that. Okay. And the next one, like, kind of hold up a little bit, kind of flex it a little bit like that. Okay. That question implies that I don't think I can take it as far as I want, and I think I can. But in a lot of ways, I feel like I'm letting a lot of people down who have been supporting me for a long time now. I think the best way for me to give back is to post good results. I want to win everything. And I want to keep doing this until that happens. I don't really believe in talent. I don't really believe that obstacles cannot be overcome through the correct application of effort. And so I just want to keep improving and see what happens. I literally have stopped doing anything that I don't think will help me get better at StarCraft. Just the amount of hand-eye coordination and control that it takes. I always used to say that back in the Warcraft 3 days that if they had a camera that showed the player's keyboard and their mouse what they were actually doing at the same time when they were actually playing, just so people could understand how quickly that they're moving around and doing stuff. Because and, and, you, know, you don't really get that appreciation. Right now, a layman looking at this is just... It, yeah, it's chess. You gotta, it, the smartest guy is going to win. That's not true. The smartest guy can lose to the faster guy every time. It takes a very different gamer and a very different personality to be good at Counter-Strike than, than in StarCraft II. I mean, even when I was a gigantic fan of Counter-Strike, you know, I always, when I would watch the RTS players, I would always say, these are the most skilled gamers out there. It's the guys that are the best at this are the most Yeah, he always would tell me gamers. that. He's like, have you ever seen the APM on these guys and how many actions they have to do? My name is Chad Jones. I'm 21. I'm going to school for pre-med. At this event, this probably wasn't my best MLG. I was in urgent care Friday morning. Um, I have Crohn's disease and it flared up. Uh, Crohn's disease is a... Uh, your immune system attacks your intestines. Um, so if you eat something that you shouldn't, like say something simple like a McDonald's hamburger, like that's enough to set it off. Well, I haven't been feeling all that great. Um, so this MLG, I did okay for the circumstances. Uh, complexity is really easy going. Um, they say school is number one. Yeah, they don't make you practice a certain amount of hours a day or anything like that. And they don't force you, you know, if you don't get top results, you know, you're kicked out or something like that. We care about these guys 
and we genuinely encourage them to stay in school if they're in or if they want to drop out of school and go to esports we've always been big on okay well we want a roadmap for when you're going to go back to school when you're going to get your degree how you're going to proceed on with your life because esports as a player can't last forever and we're not here to milk people and and take advantage of them and be like everyone should quit move into our house and play video games 23 hours a day screw school screw your family screw your life it's not like that if you care about somebody you can't do that this is the first time i think i've seen three day pressure win a game there's the gg and this kelly Alexi massacres the flex of these hard make it look like throws down his uh and set up You know that there's a lot of sacrifice from the family's perspective you know just I have to work all day and then I have to work on complexity at nights and weekends I have a flexible job so that allows me to do complexity stuff during the day sometimes as well but uh, you know there's it, it gets, it's daunting we have a huge crowd here we have audiences we've never seen before for the first time in all of my years of doing this, I don't have to lie about the numbers. You know, it's it's been a, a wonderful experience to be able to you know throw out a number that's actually true. You know, and it's not an inflation of it. I mean, it's always something I believed could grow, and right now it's it's kind of at the precipice of something great. I think. I, I'm really excited for what the future holds. It's uh, Championship Sunday, it's Sunday morning. We have Gonzi here playing in losers round five of the champ bracket. He's playing in Nori. He's currently up game one, and uh, game two actually just went live. Uh, the first game was good. He started off with early pressure, held it. Then uh, it got a little scary. I mean, I got a little nervous when he had a lot of Colossus shooting down, but uh, his Viking control was just awesome, and the spreads of his Marauders and reinforcements, he was able to take the game rather easily. Oh uh, yeah, 100%. I feel like he's going to win it. I have full confidence. He's in uh, Gonzi form after a rough Friday. Uh, the event was kind of rough for complexity, uh, especially for Hart and Gonzi, who uh, Hart went 0-5 in pool play, which is, you know, two MLGs ago in Columbus, he went 5-0. Gonzi started 0-3, came back, you know, 2-3. I mean, he survived the longest in the tournament, just being knocked out by uh, Nori a couple minutes ago. But um, it was a very rough tournament for us. Now we didn't place anywhere where we wanted to place. Definitely going to throw a couple back tonight and just try to try to forget some of the things that happened. But at the same time, you don't want to forget because we have to rebuild and come back even stronger next time.